My relationship with Catalina goes back 20 years. We met in 2003. We met at work, and you know how uh, most of us say at one point or another that we spend more time with the people we work with in our fam than our families? Well, in the case of Catalina and I, we became family. So we went our separate ways uh, it, professionally, but our friendship remained. So over the years, I've seen Catalina grow professionally. Um, she started in her career uh, in media, as I am also, in research and then in sales, and she's really blossomed while at the same time giving of her time to the community for various causes. Just an amazing individual who gives of her time, of her energy, of her resources, who shares her life um, and all that she has learned, all that she has become to be able to help the community uh, at large, especially Hispanic students, to try and reach their dreams at the university, to try and, and become. Um, so she gives back to the community every single day trying to make sure that other students have the same opportunities that she had to contribute to, um, to our society at large. Catalina's family first attitude is bar none. She is a wonderful daughter, wife, and mother to Luca and Sofia, her biggest pride and joy. I believe that Catalina truly deserves being the 2023 Hispanic Woman of the Year. Through her work, she has helped Hispanic businesses expand their reach and make them very successful. Also, she has, through her research and knowledge of the Hispanic community, has also helped the overall community learn about who we are and how we can interact with them and benefit with the overall community. Catalina Botero deserves this award because of the way she gives of herself unconditionally, both to the community as a mentor, as well as to raising her family all at the same time. I've known Gata for probably over 15 years now. Um, just a, an amazing woman, and I've been happy to serve on several councils and committees with her over these many years serving our community. I am so incredibly proud of her. Um, from the humble beginnings uh, to come into this country, uh, to the schooling, to um, her, her marriage, to her family, and certainly to uh, all of the, the, the small components of service that she provides on a daily basis to our community. I'm just so incredibly proud of her, incredibly proud of the work that she's put in and the continuous work that she puts every day to make our community better. Um, we work here, we live here, we play here, we learn here. Um, and she's a part of that. She makes Tampa better. She makes our community significantly better. Um, so incredibly proud of you, Kata. Well, tú sabes cómo es la cosa, que yo me emociono a veces en las reuniones o en los eventos. So we have this thing now that is not a party until Margarita cries. <laughs> Kata, I could not be more proud and happier that you are this year's Hispanic woman and welcome to the club. Now, you probably don't believe it yet, but really, you got this. <laughs>